Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to show you guys how to jailbreak, uh, I believe it's any iPhone from iOS 11 to 11.1.2. <laughs> the only requirements for this are, of course, that you have your iPhone and it needs to be from iOS 11 to 11.1.2. So let's get started. The first three things you're going to need are these three apps right here, Zip App Free, uh, Fills Escape, and Electra. So I'm going to show you guys how to get those three apps real quick. For Zip App Free, you're going to want to go to the App Store. Go to search and search up zip app free right there. And it's gonna be this top one with the green icon. You just wanna go ahead and uh, download that one. Now for Phil's Escape and Electra, you're gonna wanna go to this website. I'm gonna leave all the, the websites in the description below, just so you guys can go have like an easy way to get to them. All right, so this is the website right here. You're gonna wanna click uh, on this X on the top left to get rid of the ad. You wanna go to apps tweak box apps and go down right here electro jailbreak you want to click install and install again i'm not going to do that because i already have mine and then fills escaped i want to click install and install again of course i'm again i'm not going to do it because i already have it installed um after this in order to actually open them you're gonna have to go to settings you're gonna want to go to general and down to profiles and device management here you're going to want to click on wherever the apps are at and then you're going to want to verify both of them. Just click verify and verify again and you'll be good. Now after this, what you want to do is go to Electra. And this is to actually jailbreak your device. You want to wait and click on the X to get rid of the ad. And um, after that, you, right here where it says already jailbroken, there's going to be a button that says jailbreak. No, I'm not going to do it because I already have my device jailbroken and it's not going to let me. But once you click jailbreak, it's just going to say jailbreaking one out of three and then two out of three. And then once it gets to three out of three, it's going to basically respring. You're just going to see the little respring loop. And after this, your device is going to start back up and you're going to have this new app called Anima, which is right here. And this one is actually for the themes. But it's all, uh, jailbreaking is also going to allow you to get the tweaks. So after this, you want to go to Safari. And of course, again, I'm going to leave all the websites in the description below just so you can easily access them. You're going to want to go to the Tweaks website. And the one I'm going to show you guys to get today is actually Cylinder, which actually adds a little effect when, uh, when switching from pages on your phone. So we're going to click right here on Cylinder, and it's going to bring you to this website. Here I want to click on open and zip app free. If it doesn't show zip app free and it shows a different app, you're going to click on more and then copy to zip app free. So once you do that, it's going to bring you to the app zip app free. I'm going to click yes. And then it's going to give you this blue folder that's on top. You want to click on this blue folder. Here you just want to worry about the one that says data. So click on data and click yes again. And now you can click edit and just delete these extra ones. You're not going to need them anymore. You're gonna click done. From here, you're all done with these with the zip app free. Then you're gonna go to Filza Escape. Now you're just gonna wait a little bit for it to open. All right, so you're gonna get an ad. All you wanna do is just wait and then click the X on top. This is where it gets a little bit hard. So here you wanna click on the the button on the bottom right, and you wanna click activate and done. And you wanna click on the A the, on the bottom left, the little folder with an A. Here you're going to access your apps and you want to go down to zip app free right there click on documents and imported files now right here we can wait a little bit you want to click back on the little button on the bottom right and you want to go back to where you were which is this one here you want to go all the way back just click the top left so you go all the way back to the dash then you want to click on bootstrap library and sb inject so right here we're done. Now you want to go back to where you were and click on cylinder, data, library, and you want to click on mobile substrate and then dynamic libraries. Now these are the two the two uh, documents that you want to transfer to SB inject. You do have to do one at a time. I'm not sure why, but it might give you like an error if you do both at the same time. So you're gonna want to copy one at a time. Click on it and then bottom left it says copy, just click copy and then you want to go back, you want to click the button on the bottom right and go back to the SB inject 
and here you want to click the button on the bottom left and then click paste once he, this is done you want to want to click on the eye of uh, cylinder the one that's highlighted click on sticky and click on mask and change it to 0777 and then save it and then go back and then done and then you want to do the same exact thing for the other document so you're going to click copy you want to go back paste it and again you want to click the eye go to sticky and change it to 0777 and then save it and go back and done right here you want to go back to library and you want to go to preference bundles now you want to go back to where you were and then go back and back right here you want to go to where it says preference bundles and then this is the folder that you want to transfer back to where you were so you're going to click edit copy that folder copy and then go back to preference bundles on top and then click paste and the same exact thing we're going to click on the i sticky and 0777 and then save it back and done and then you want to go back on the button on the bottom right go back to where you were here you want to click on uh, preference loader preferences and this document you want to transfer so click uh, edit highlight it copy and then go back and then here you want to go back to library and click on preference loader preferences and you want to paste it here now the same exact thing click on the i sticky and change it to 0777 save back and done now we're almost done one more step you want to go all the way back again right here all the way back to the dash you want to go to library and this is where you're going to paste the last file so you want to go back to that other page and right here where it says cylinder you actually want to copy this one copy and you want to go back over here to library and paste and paste and then you want to click on the eye again sticky 0777 and save now you want to click back to cylinder and done and basically here you're done the last thing you want to do since you have animal just click on uh, the app and this is just to respring since we don't really have a, another way to respring right now click on preview and then click on apply right here the device is actually going to respring so just wait for it to turn back on real quick and there you go it's back on so right here you just want to unlock it and then as you can see it's already uh, doing animations but to change those you want to go to settings it's the same as if you downloaded a tweet from Cydia you want to go down and right here cylinder here you can change the effect you have the one I'm using right now is uh, motion UI you can use a different one explosion you can use more than one at a time but explosion you can try that one that one looks pretty cool and then you can choose more there's different ones here and that's basically how you get the tweaks alright guys now I'm gonna show you how to get the themes on your iPhone uh, it's basically kinda of the same process um, so what you're gonna want to do is first go to Safari and like I said before I'm gonna leave the links in the description below just so you can go straight to them this is the other website with all the themes that are compatible at the moment the ones they have tried I believe um, here you can see there's a couple of themes that you can uh, click on and try the ones that I actually have right now are um, I have slushy lotus and oyster so those are the three that I'm using right now but I'm gonna download another one just to, sh to show you guys uh, actually how to do it so I'll just choose insight So I'll just choose insight we're gonna click on insight right there and it's gonna bring you back to this website again here you're gonna click open and zip app free if it's not there click on more and here copy to zip app free and it's gonna take you to the zip app uh, app here you're gonna click yes now let me delete these other ones just so you guys don't get confused you're gonna click on the folder again you're just gonna worry about the one that says data click on data and click yes and of course again it's gonna give me another um, folder here you can just edit and delete these extra ones that you're not gonna need anymore and click OK click done and here you have your folder so from here what you want to do is go back to go back to fields escape 
right there. So wait for it to open it up. And it's basically the same process, just with a few less uh, steps. Just wait for the ad to come up and click skip. Here, you can just go all the way back, all the way back to the dash. And right here, you're going to go to Bootstrap, Library, and this time, you're going to click on Themes. Uh, so from here, you want to go to the button on the bottom right. Click uh, Activate and Done. And then click on the bottom left little folder with an A. Here, you're going to go to the Apps Manager where you can uh, actually access the Zip app. Here you're going to go to documents and import files and right here you're going to see the file that we just got. You want to click on the blue folder, uh, data, library, and themes. And as you can see right here, there's three folders. Again, we want to do one at a time because uh, if you do all three of them, it's probably going to give you an error and uh, it might mess up something. So click edit, click on the first one, copy, and then we want to go back to the themes. And here you're going to click paste. And paste and again you want to click on the I and go to sticky and give it full permission so click 0777 and save then you can click back and done here you're gonna click again on the bottom right uh, corner the button and you go back to themes and then you want to click edit and then click on the other one which is the one in the middle copy and then go back to the other themes page click paste and paste and then we're going to click on the I, sticky, again, mask 0777, save, and then go back and done. And then one more time, we're going to go back to the themes, go to edit, click on the last one, copy, and then go back to the other one, paste and paste. And then you want to click on the I, sticky, and again, change it to 0777, save, back, and done. And right here, you're basically done. So it's just a few less steps, but um, pretty much the same thing. Right here, you can go back home and you want to make sure that your Animo um, app is closed. So just close it out real quick. And then you can go back home and then go to Animo. And then just wait for it to start up. And then. Uh, Click right here and then you can let me take off the old one and I can just click on the new one which is right here at the bottom insight 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 so these are the three that we just uh, installed click on preview and it's just going to show us actually how the theme is going to look and then we want to click on apply we just want to wait for this little respring logo to go away and it's going to turn on the device again as you can see the device now turned on again you just want to unlock it and now that you can see the apps actually changed it's a new theme now um, I do have a couple more tweaks and uh, different themes and stuff on this device if you guys want to see um, some of these tweaks just let me know in the comments below and I'll actually show you exactly step by step I'll make a separate video to show you guys exactly how to get each of them um, if you guys want to see more uh, videos about like top tweaks and stuff like that top themes just let me know in the description below give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and that's basically it